basically with the cuts we've gone through in staffing, we wouldn't even be able to keep the schools as clean as we are now if we weren't doing this. Right. In our district, we're doing three hundred for doing five point two million square feet with three hundred and seventy three custodians. We're going to be doing seven point four million square feet with three hundred and thirty three custodians this year. And because of this, we're able to do it. Major statement. So in the past couple of years, what's happened is we've opened schools up with a reduction in custodial staff. Well, somewhere along the line, you would think we'd have to adjust that service contract. That's not the case now because, like you said, where are we doing it in the past? We were. We had the numbers. Now we're still able to do that because we have the proper tools and the equipment to approach that and make it happen. Right. Without this, absolutely not. Well, I mean, it would have been very, very difficult with the numbers of custodians and employees we have in the district now. So we're going green, we're using the microfiber, there's a lot of good things that are happening with the taxpayers' dollars. Yeah. So they need to know that. I've had principals and administrators comment on, they know their school is getting clean more efficient than it was before. You know, they notice the cleanliness is picking up in it. So we're getting a lot of positive feedback. Right. I mean, feedback from custodians too. Actually, I got one here that told me, if she ever had to go back to the old way of cleaning, she'll quit. Right. Well, and your tools have made you able to do high and low things without bending over, where before you used to have to bend down to get the things on the floor. Now you've got tools that are able to do it. Yeah. You're getting the dust off high. You're cleaning baseboards and corners. Absolutely. Things we couldn't do before. And with the trawl, you're able to do the boards and not leave them streaked, and it's done in a one-motion process. Where the tools have made the speed of the job much easier, and they are not as tired when they finish the night of their route. And they're doing more classrooms per night than what they did before, but they're still not as tired.